Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go once again. It's your man. Bobby Las Vegas presents The Game is the Game NFL Week 8. How's everybody doing out there? I'm um, coming out to you for another version of this game this game making um making um some picks with, with the NFL. Um last week was a good week, went four and oh. Picked the Packers, uh the Bucks, the Titans, and the Colts. So right now for the season I am seventeen, sixteen, and one. All right, nothing to write home about, but I'm definitely above uh five hundred. All right, let's start it off with um, this week. We have um, 49ers versus the Bears. Now, I'm not going to lie, man. I struggled, I struggled, I struggled, I struggled. I struggled with this one. Chase the line. And both teams are definitely retooling by the end of the season. Trust me, both teams are going to be rebuilding. Um, 49ers need to be more consistent on defense. Chicago needs offense. Um, Chicago will not have their coach. They will not have, um, Khalil Mack, but, um, there's something missing from the 49ers. They should be running the ball on everybody, getting how many yards, but their, their offense is just not consistent. Will they, will the Bears win? No. But will the uh, 49ers cover? No. I'm taking the Bears plus the, uh, four. Now, when when betting, there's a lot of different ways that people go at it. And when I look at the Lions, I actually use all three. And that's analytics, momentum, and emotions. Um, analytics-wise, they're hanging in almost every game. They're being really tough. Momentum is that continue to fight. And the emotions part is... Their coach. Their coach keeps them fired up. I mean, they're really trying hard. And I believe, um, you know, and I hate to say, if they can't win this one, um, things are going to really be tough. I feel if there's going to be a game to win, going against the Eagles, um, Jalen Hurts has a poor um, passing percentage. The Lions are hungry. And I'm sure the Eagles are going to, you know, go in and not be a pushover. But if there's going to be the game for them to win, to get off the schneid, it's going to be this one. Next game is another game I deliberate, deliver, win against for so long. You know, looked at it, looked at it, chased the line, looked at it, looked at it. And with everything coming out that uh, Dak is probably not going to play. I'm going to go for the Vikes. I'm scared of the Vikes. You know, everybody talk about their lack of kicking game, but I think they're a little bit more consistent. Plus, they're playing at home. Um, Cowboys have been putting up the points, but of course, they've been putting up the points with Dak. So no matter if Dak starts or not, I'm sure the other kid, Cooper Rush, is going to get into the game. Therefore, I'm um, taking the Vikes, giving two and a half. Next, we got the Patriots versus the Chargers. I mean, Patriots, they're a solid team. I mean, they got the pieces. I mean, there's just nothing flashy about them. However, they're doing, the, they're doing that thing. East Coast team going to the West Coast. Um, and I also think it's a back to reality where the Chargers got mopped up a couple of weeks ago. But I think they're going to... Um, they're going to be back there. They're going to be swinging. And they're going to show kind of a killer attitude because um, that AFC West, East, I mean, excuse me, AFC West is something else. So you get, they got to get some wins. And I just don't believe the uh, Patriots have enough weapons or trick plays to go up against the Chargers. Therefore, I'm taking the Chargers uh, minus three and a half. Uh, next. This is a Monday night game. And this one's really no uh, true analysis. It's Giants versus the Chiefs. If if it's not now, then when? When are you going to beat somebody? When are you going to beat somebody in a smaller caliber and run it up at home? Therefore, I'm taking the Chiefs. Minus, I believe it's 10. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, 
if the Chiefs can't do this game against the Giants at home, it, it's a done deal. So the, the, the Giants are tough. They got pieces. A uh, few of the receivers are coming back. But for the Chiefs, they need this game. Or I think if they, if they don't beat the Giants and beat the Giants well, season's over. So that's how we have them taking the Bears, Lions, Vikings, Chargers, and the Chiefs. Alrighty, so make it going. Check out some of these games. NFL Week Eight. Like and subscribe. Come out and check me. Um, that's about it. The game is a game. Everybody have a great one.